The House of Representatives threatened to issue arrest warrants to almost 15 companies and agencies over non-remittances into the nation's federation account. Lawmakers said the companies, which include telecoms giant MTN, Glow and Airtel, have refused to appear before the House Committee on Finance and the course of investigating agencies, which have defaulted in payments to the federation account. Upon the receipt of letters of petition, chose instead to file cases in court. The House notes a judgment in favor of National Assembly was delivered on the 13th of March 2020 by Lot by Hadoshi BFM Yago J, which reiterated that National Assembly is empowered by sections 889 of the Constitution to invite any persons for investigating purposes. Mr. Speaker, it is funny that when those companies were seeking for registration, they came as individuals. Individuals as, as corporate company, individuals as persons to go to Corporate Affairs Commission to seek for registration with their various companies. Now it comes to the issue of remitting what is supposed to be partly what should go to the services of our nation. They want to come as an association to say, no, we will not come to National Assembly, we will not, we will not be held accountable, because they have called what is called an illegal as far as I'm concerned, association. This should not be encouraged, it should not be allowed, we should do our work. And I'm saying for emphasis, Mr. Speaker, that such lawyers, if they are emphasis, if they are provisions, for them to be sanctioned, you are seeing a country, it's only in Nigeria that this nonsense will happen. <laughs> So that we exhaust the issue of fair hearing. 